الحمد لله كثيرا وسبحان الله وبحمده مطلقا واصيلا لا اله الا الله وحده صدق وعده ونصر عبده وعز جنوده وهدم الاحزاب وحده لا شيء مبارك عيد ومن تعيد ترى ان شاء الله الله forgiving because greatness and true gratitude shows itself not when you are like Yusuf عليه السلام and at the bottom of the well it doesn't show itself when you're in your broken state, when you're ostracized, when you're bullied, when your family makes fun of you because you're more religious now. When you are harassed at your job. When you feel lonely within yourself even. That's not when, when uh, gratitude necessarily shows itself. You know when it shows itself? At your highest point. Again, like you, Sufani Salaam, when you have people in front of you and you have the power to take vengeance. La tathriba alaykum al who said the same words? Muhammad How do you know me? We have never seen evil from you. You're our brother, son of another man who we know. Abdullah is he? The father of the Prophet. And the Prophet said, La tathriba alaykum al Today he has no harm to you. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. That is gratitude. It is gratitude towards Allah that you are kind and gentle with the slaves. You know, Eid many times becomes the most annoying day for our youngsters, for elderly. When we try to make such a good appearance that we rush people when we do a dressing up, when we do this, when we do that, that we lose the kindness in between, not understanding that it's about us. It's about my child, it's about my family. That's what it's about. It's not about the fancy dresses, the clothes, the perfumes. I want the nice pictures, the Eid selfies, the food afterwards, the breakfast, the invitations. This is not what it's about. Reading is about celebrating and sharing that joy so that other and others fall asleep with it. It is beautifying our celebration and our connection with Allah SWT. And in the second part, I'm going to address a small story of Muhammad SAW, what he did on one of the incidents when he was reading. الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر لا إله إلا الله الله أكبر الله أكبر ولله الحمد الحمد لله رب العالمين اللهم صل على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أجمعين ثم بعد There's a narration which I came across that Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم when he was walking once met one of his companions crying. He met this companion crying and his heart becomes merciful, of course, when he sees one of his dear friends, companions, followers, brothers and sisters, shed tears. So he asked, why are you crying? Imagine you see somebody crying when you leave the masjid in the brothers and sisters section area and you ask, why are you crying, brother and sister? And then that brother answered that he's orphan. His parents, father or mother or both, died. And that he has no one who basically celebrates with him, that he misses his loved ones. Are you pleased that you celebrate with us? I become your father and Aisha becomes your mother. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. You know, Muhammad وسلم, had another tradition. The orphans of Ja'far, the brother of Ali radiallahu On certain days, he visited them to show them that he is there. At least another father figure for them, parents figure. Since they lost their father in the battle, Ja'far of the one of the two weeks. Now let me please you. What I'm trying to get at is this. If you want to be truly grateful to Allah, 
Pray to the slaves how you want to be treated, Allah. They say, I treat people how you want to be treated by people. No. Treat people how you want to be treated by Allah and Muhammad system. How do you want Allah to treat you? Would you want people to smile in your face when you see them? Definitely. No one wants an angry looking person to stare at them, right? No, no, I like angry stares, brother. That's my thing. I don't know, that's a different issue we have to solve later. <laughs> I like harsh words, scream at me. That is some people say, when the khutbah is aggressive, he spoke in haq. <laughs> no, he was angry. It's not haq. Mashallah, I, I felt the khutbah. Why? Why do you like to be abused? You want to be yelled at? That's part of it. Sometimes you have to be louder when you speak. But that's not what it's about. Who would want a person to treat them with love, care, kindness? Imagine you speak to somebody and you know you will never be judged. There will be understanding brought towards you. And you can let down your armor. Become somebody people are grateful for, people thank Allah for. And Allah will give you so much which you can be grateful for. Again, if you are a person which makes people be grateful to Allah, Alhamdulillah for you in my life then you can expect to be so grateful that Allah will leave you speechless with the generosity of a king. I ask Allah SWT to turn us to people who become an ease in the life of others. I ask Allah SWT to become so grateful that by merely associating with us, people become grateful as well. And I ask Allah SWT to become people who are so convinced and what Allah has promised them that they are ambitious, that they have drive, enthusiasm, and that it was a start for their new life, where they decided to become beacons of light, to not only change their own life, the life of their families, but to improve the world as a whole. Barakallahu fikum, Eid Mubarak, Jazakallahu khairan. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, La ilaha illallah. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Walillahi Alhamdulillah. I'm gonna start praying, inshallah. And when I, when I go out, I'll finish it up. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Walillahi Alhamdulillah. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. La ilaha illallah, Allahu Akbar, walillahi alhamd. Allahu Akbar kabira, walhamdulillahi kathira, wa subhanallahi wa bihamdihi bukhata wa asila. Allahu Akbar kabira, walhamdulillahi kathira, wa subhanallahi bukhata wa asila. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. La ilaha illallah. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, لا إله إلا الله وحده صدق وعده ورسل عبده وعز جنده وهدف الأحزاب وحده لا شيء قد له ولا شيء بعده لا إله إلا الله وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر لا Allah, 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 Allah,
الله اكبر 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 